Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. New evidence has surfaced that confirms a big Pokemon game is still happening for the Nintendo Switch. If you all remember back in 2019, Detective Pikachu Part 2 was announced for the Switch but since then we've heard nothing about this game. Thankfully, Pokemon developer Creatures Inc. has updated their job recruitment website and this update to the website confirms that Detective Pikachu Part 2 is still in development and has not been cancelled. In a translated post on Creatures Inc.'s website, you'll find this message from one of the developers. It's not like a universal tool to make, but a mechanism that will be a plus. I am in charge of programming around drawing in the project related to the sequel to Detective Pikachu and at the Environment Development Office. I am creating a mechanism that will be the basis of future gaming production in general. Now, I'm not going to read the rest of this because it's not related to Detective Pikachu, but if you want to, feel free. The source link is in the description box. But as you can clearly see here, the sequel to Detective Pikachu has not been cancelled according to this developer. Now there was another translation on this website and it goes as this. We are working on supporting physically based rendering and looking for a balance between realism and Pokemonness. As new technologies appear every day, super resolution technologies such as ray tracing and DLSS may become indispensable. We are also paying attention to the technology introduced in the latest game engines such as Unreal Engine 5. So, according to these translations, it seems as though this next Detective Pikachu game will look more realistic and not really cartoonish like all the Pokemon games look, but we'll see what happens. Hopefully we get some type of trailer for this game sometime this year, maybe at E3 or maybe at the end of the year, but hey, we'll see what happens. Alright everyone, that's going to do it for this video. What are your thoughts on everything that was discussed here? Please let me know down in the comment section. And please, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And as always, remember to keep it locked here at Around the Clock. We're here, we focus on Nintendo news content around the clock. I'll catch you guys in the next one.